if you have any pre-gig rituals that you go through kind of superstitiously or do you, do you eat something before you go on stage or I don't I'm not really into like routines or superstitions I mean I usually try to warm up a little bit um, which just means singing through some songs um, in the bathroom where it's echoey um, I've been doing my own makeup for the show so that kind of helps put me in the mood to get on stage um, am I in the right spot should I move back It'd be cool to be buried with like the Led Zeppelin greatest hits album, you know? I mean, just get the, the favorites. That would be cool. I could live with that. Or die with it, rather. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I just want to be remembered for singing my face off, you know? I think good music, you know? Uh, you know, all the other things about my personality, my personal life, controversy, idol, this or that, that's all secondary, you know? It's hopefully it's about rocking it out, you know? I hope so. And I hope that Slash convinces me to be Bella Revolver's new frontman. I don't know if that's happening, but we actually are talking about some collaborations, so stay tuned for that. Yeah, no, we we we, we text back and forth. So, yeah, he's a cool guy. Does he, does he do the LOL? And the, uh... Uh, he, no, he doesn't do the stupid text lingo. No, he's good. He's a little bit more sophisticated than that. <laughs> hey guys, this is Adam Lambert, and you're watching rockarazzi.com.